All right. Let's jump into a short little indie horror game called The Convenience Store. So all I really know about this game is it's only like two hours or less to, to play it from what I've seen online. And it's by an indie developer on that's on Steam that has like a ton of different games. So we'll see how this one is. Maybe we'll play more, maybe we don't. Not really set on anything, but let's take our time. This will be a shorter stream than usual, so I'll just be kind of trying to soak it in. Oh, there was cat hair in that. Yuck. <coughs> your fault. Not your fault, kitty. All right. Well, without further ado, let's jump in. Okay, that's already loud. Okay. Keeping an eye on my audio levels. Oh god, it's time. Need to get ready for work. Oh, is it supposed to be this blurry? Is it supposed to be this way? Uh, Slept well. It's supposed to look like this. There wasn't any visual settings. I guess it's not terrible. You can just tell it's kind of bleeding over. Just so I slept well. Look at this. It's exactly like my room in real life. So they live in a studio. So I can only interact with the door. They make that pretty obvious. Oh. This must be other studios, because I mean, I have a bed, a fridge, a TV, and a... It's dark outside. The cl clock stopped. Change clothes? Maybe I was supposed to do that. So you have like oh, so this is my whole house. Okay, let's bring a flashlight. Oh, did I just answer no? Okay. Very interesting graphical style. Like it looks like a it's like a V it has like VHS lines, right? Is that what it's going for? You eat something, change, and grab a flashlight. Okay, so I just need to eat them. Well, you didn't like the bag of chips? What do I do with this? Can I close that? Or can I turn this on? Oh, 
How long is it going in for? It's not gonna like burn down the house or something. Right? Yeah, I'll leave my bento box. Hi, Luna. Oh, I can't have the cat cam on because I'm stuck. Oh, wait. No, I can have the cat cam on. Hmm. That one's. Wait, where is it? Oh, it's not set up. No cat cam right now. Uh, I use that camera for Rock Band. Um. Oh, great! Now, oh, now can I leave? The audio levels are fine. Is there any other buttons besides just like walking and clicking? Hey, what's up, Frulio? Fuzzy Pickles? What's up? And I'm doing good. I had a busy day at work, but. <sighs> Stressful, but good. I'm just chilling. Just kind of walking around. Can I walk off ledges? Oh, you can. I'm a little surprised you can. I wonder if there's such thing as fall damage or fatal fall damage. Or if there's even health in this game, like what's... You doing well? Good. Good, good. I have had like a scratchy throat the last few days, which is kind of annoying. And like, I think I've been a little bit under the weather. Oh, there's a convenience store. Like, not like too bad, but it's just like a little bit of fatigue and just kind of just like light headache. And I just haven't been sleeping well enough. And like my throat hurts. I'd have a little bit of a cough. And it's just like not healing. Like ever since I played Rock Band. Hi. What's up, my dude? Oh, God, you made it. Hmm. Oh, no. It's just that I recently heard someone had fell off the bridge you just crossed. There was an old lady... That said she had saw a man walk down the street with his legs completely bent the other way. Scary stuff. If only this was a true story. <laughs> Sorry. But yeah, I, I have been sleeping better.
What the for damn nine persons, nine hours, nine doors, or whatever order it is. I would have slept much better. Thank you for always keeping the toilet clean. Oddly convincing. But I was just enjoying that game. And it was just like, it kept taking just longer than I expected it to at every turn. Character I've been drinking only that recently. Highly recommended. Can I not grab this? Yeah, I get it's recommended. Looks like some has expired. Shelf looks fine. Shelf looks fine. Ooh, this looks good. Yeah, that flow tree made things way easier. It, it was almost like too convenient to the point where like... Where it's like, okay, I could click here and then only get new content, but I'm going to click back a little way just so I can get the context of the situation just a little bit better. But at the same time... They also kind of like repeat um, key information a lot. So even if you jump ahead, the game kind of uh, it cl clues you back in. Why is this a thing? I can't. Move, interact, Q's drop, F is flashlight. Oh, shift is run. Well, it doesn't look like run works right now. I can't turn off the flashlight. Also, that game had me talking way more than I'm used to. I just came in again. Sorry. You're good. Uh, yes. You cool with this? Punch in? Oh, I'm supposed to... I work here? Is this the machine? I thought I was just being a creep. I think some food has expired by the time you start your shift. Can you take them off the shelf for me? Your manager. Closed circuit television. Someone's coming in. What's up? Okay, you're taking forever. Oh, wait, is that what you want? No, nope. okay. Well, I'm gonna grab the exp expired stuff then. Uh, what am I supposed to do with this? Where's the trash? Oh, I guess that's what the trash bin is in the back. Now, don't steal anything while I'm out, please. Yes, yes. Alright, let's... 
I'm running. This is running speed. Oh, excuse my absence. Well, let me rig you up. Hello, hello. Yes, yes. Wow, I'm a great employee. Bye bye. You're off into the void. How do I exit this? So I have a question. Like, oh, did I hear another one coming in? What are they doing out there? What, why did that door open? So... How did you hear about this game and have you played it yourself? I'm wondering if something different shows up on the closed circuit versus what I see. Okay, I can't look left and right, just up and down. Just a little bit. Okay, I guess I'll per Oh, there's a zoom in button. Yes, yes. Oh, look at all these goodies. Doesn't go... Wait, what can I... Looks like some are expired. Oh. Yes, yes. I'll take care of this. Yes. I've never worked at a convenience store. I did work at... A Dairy Queen. Other than that, I don't really deal. I never had to like deal with like customer service. Chef looks fine. Check all expiration dates on the shelves. Oh, spoilers. Oh yes, my manager may as well just give me a raise now. Cause apparently I checked everything. What else can I do here? These all like sweet buns or something? What's up? How's it going, dude? What'd you got? It's kind of late for a delivery man at this time, huh? We've recently incorporated this system exclusively for convenience stores that are open late at night. Looks like this package is directly shipped to the store. Oh, and the name matches your tag? I think this is for you. Alright, I'll receive it. Thank you, my good sir. You have a great night, my dude. 
And this box uh, doesn't look the most like the most pleasant thing in the world. Oh yes, of course, of course. Is that it? Jeez, what the fuck was that? Okay, we're... Yum, yum, yum. My favorite little chinchilla. Oh, this is like my work uniform. Uh-huh. Oh. Let's pop this in. God, my ears. Is that loud? Wait, what? Wasn't I making food in the microwave? I don't because it don't look like I could interact with this. The hell was that supposed to be? I have to get myself a bento box for the way home. Well, now that I watched the ring tape, I just have seven days to live, so this game's not that long. Does this need electrical code? What's happening? First night? What does that mean? Am I going back to work? So it looks like they just kind of put me in this, like, I'm just going to work, right? They put me in this, like, repetitive routine is the word I'm looking for. And now, once, now that I'm on a routine, they're going to fuck with me. Is that what they're going to do? It's so much darker than the first night already. We'll see what this game does. I have zero expectations. This is a game on Steam. So like, I don't know. I don't, th I think it's going to be tame, but we'll see. I have no idea what that tape was. Was it? It looked like it was just like a low angle of just 
maybe the convenience store or maybe it was like someone's house. What's up? Hey, hey. So I heard that you reported that the doors would open on their own. Well, we got a guy to check out the sensor and seems like the wiring were loose. Oh? You thought it was some sort of poltergeist? I see the things on TV all the time. But they're all scripted. Ghosts aren't real after all. It's not that they're scripted, it's just that there's this, a different explanation for it. For a lens flare that just kind of looks spooky. Alright. Could you please punch in? Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Sorry. Alright, let's see what uh, the old manager wants me to do today. I saw some rats behind the store today. Someone must have left the garbage bin open. The first person to see this note has to get rid of the rodents ASAP. Wouldn't that have been you, manager, who wrote this? You would have been the first to see it? You son of a bitch. Alright, before anyone shows up here, let's, uh... I'll see if I could get the, uh, the Kimbo shotguns to take them out. this ho, 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 ho. okay the rat extermination spray sorry little buddy Not personal. Oh, oh, I need to get back. I need to get back. Come on, one last. Damn it. Must kill. That must have been someone else that left that open. That couldn't have been me. Where's Granny? Is she going to the bathroom? Don't tell me she's gonna like die or something. Look, look at this asshole. Hey, fucker, go repark your car. You're in a hurry? Are you? So 
please fetch you. What? How about you do those things? Or fuck off? He even say please. Where, where are the cigars? <sighs> Go get it yourself. Yeah, asshole. What, do I need to grab one beer at a time? You're on dr Wait, oh shit. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh no, I keep dropping it. Oh no, hopefully it's not too shaken when you drink it. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this one that's been sitting out all day and it's warm? Okay. Oh, oh, shoot. I'm, I'm really clumsy about this. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. If this guy walks out... Where are the cigars? I want to get the cigar first. Is that a cigar back there? Like... These are cigarettes. Maybe it's a translation thing. Yeah, it appears like that works. Should just drop in the dumpster. Well, I know you're in a hurry, so I'm just gonna really go as fast as I can here. Really? Oh no. Oh god. I'm so clumsy. Oh no. I feel like he's gonna like walk out as soon as I turn around for this last one. She said, thank you. Well, you're welcome. Wow, that must have been a real emergency. Where's the old woman? I want to watch her on the the video feed. She's just chilling. Oh no! Go say hello. Where's Ken Kun? You know where Ken Kun is? That hurt his voice. 
This was my daughter's house. What did you do? How dare you? Oh, 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 oh. She's got some fire. Um. I, I don't know how to help you. I'm sorry. Now, now she's just cruising. Couldn't wait to get out of there. Yeah, she was just trying to to dodge that other a hole. Ghosts. Oh, it's a kid. It's a punk kid. Oh, they're so dead. They're so dead. I'll get, I'll, I'll get them. You punk kids. Hello, sir. You're the man that dropped off the package the other day. How? How's your night going? It's good to see you again. Oh, you know, the unstoppable trend of ordering everything online. Yeah, I'm guilty of that. Anyway, there seems to be a package that needs to be picked up here. Huh? Oh, I believe this is for you. Yes. Have a good night, my good sir. Yes. I didn't even notice that box was there. I'm glad. <laughs> glad I uh, thought before I left. One second, I just got to do something. Wait, what was I using before? It was this scene. Oh, it's upside down. No. Uh, where's the rotate button? Hey, kitty. Upside down kitty. 
Hi. How are you? Yeah. Wait, how do I rotate this? Transform? Yeah, yeah. There's the kitty. There's the kitty. Hi. She's just been staring at me for the last like 10 minutes. Maybe even longer. This attentive. What's happening? Well, is that your water now? Dude, you're just downing that water. I'm just glad you're drinking water. Hi. All right, I'm bored. Let's smoke. Oh, yes, the umbrella. Oh, you can see my umbrella. Delivery man? Dibs. Like I still have the umbrella. Hi. No, this is this is your water. You could have that one. Yeah. Where, the, where is that? That was like an update on camera. I saw like a tree and a light. Oh, thank you, Luna. Thank you. Alright, but it's still night two. But I hear like a uh, kidney disease is common with cats because they tend to not drink enough water and like they've lived in like very dry climates so they're used to not like having much water but that doesn't mean it's good for them. So yeah, keep drinking water, Luna. I hope you just love water. God, that's with the flashlight on?
Yeah, this is the spooky bitch. You didn't know about that? Oh. Well, this is... It's a cop. No, it's just like a... a thing. I'm waiting for something to appear on this bridge. Listen, I watched a lot of cat videos before I got Luna. <laughs> that was one of the things that stuck out. Yeah, so maybe, maybe, I, I'm guessing I need to restock these at one point, yes. Uh. Oh, where's my, uh, fellow co-worker? Huh? Assuming this is related to attacks I'll need to do, so let's just put those down right there. We're not in the bathroom. No, I did not. I didn't have any thoughts. I mean, <sighs> Jesus fucking. Yeah. Asshole. Okay, okay, fine, I'll stop. I promise I won't do it again. Dick! I was worried about you! Keep the shelves full, that's our motto. Please restock by tomorrow morning. I'm the best at restocking. Fucking door. Oh, looks like I need to restock right there. Only the freshest ingredients for our customers, yes. The fuck? Ah. Uh. Did my coworker lock me in here? Who did this? No one's here. Ooh. Ooh, this one. These are some steamy magnets. Gotta take some of these home for later. Why, hello, good sir. How may I help you? I'm Hamada. There's something wrong with the, with the air conditioning. Your boss seems desperate in keeping the food fresh. I hate to be working this late, but he pays me well, so, you know, don't mind me. Just quickly check the outside unit and said head right out. All right, do your work, sir. Thanks for checking in. Good luck, Hamada. Look 
So right here. Achievement? Achievement? No, there's more. Alright, what else is back here? Any of these? I'll see what else I need to restock. I mean, does that count as it not being stocked? Take one more look. Maybe gamers don't look up, so maybe I need to check higher. Trying to pick these up. Yo, what's up? It's like uh, we barricaded this. Any flavor text? No. No, oh, just walks right through that. Okay. Checking on the store. Don't see anyone here. Oh, it's like so. Oh, it's like they're coming in. Let's try to fake look busy. What up, Alice Malice? What's up? That's my AC guy. Is he off or what? Oh, he's got it here. Now and a half left of work. Nice. Again, to the home stretch. You could take your mind off of work while I fake work here on Twitch. Yes. Some work simulator to get your mind off of work. That's two days off? Nice. Oh, let me uh, scan that for you. Hey. Are you the only one working here? I can't believe this. What kind of manager puts a girl on a midnight shift alone? I'm a girl? I see you have no choice. Well, at the very least, I'll give you my protection charm. Now be careful. Oh, why, thank you. Got a with a work site. Oh, I will gladly take this site, this uh, charm though. Thank you. Love you. What would you gotta do? Right. And how you doing, Breaker? Oh, what the fuck? The fucking punk kids! You punk ass kids! You see that? See what I have to deal with? Did you let the rats in too? Can self check in? What? Don't get locked in the bathroom, please. Oh, 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 God. Oh, fuck. <laughs> no, no, I'm stuck in here. Someone's opening the doors. Mother.
motherfucker. Who's back here? You punk ass kids? What? Hide and locker, hide and locker, hide and locker. Rude ass customer, I know. That slender son of a. Oh my god. Talisman. My, these are. I don't know if I need to touch those. Can I at least pick this up? I think that one lady cursed me. What's what's up there? I'll fix the AC. What did I just do? I found a key. The key of perpetual floating and spookiness. The door's unlocked. However, my arm goes numb when I try to open it. Feels as though something is grabbing me. I need the talisman. store you know I kind of wish the game did not do that weird jump scare I wish it did everything besides that oh we have no kitty cam the mess has just been a spooky cat tower of emptiness. Exercise the door? Yeah. Manager? Oh, he's got all these videotapes. Are you drunk and just...
How am I just at home now? Yeah, I felt like if they didn't do that jump scare at the camera, all of what just happened there would have been a lot more effective in just building tension. But overall, I still think that was pretty, pretty good, pretty effective. Yeah. I wonder... Like, it seems like my shifts at the convenience store are timed. Or maybe they're not. But it seems like they're timed. So, like, maybe this is, like, trying to nudge me towards what I'm supposed to do. And that third night, I actually kind of made some progress. Also, if that's my manager, am I going to re report that? at all or what a nightmare was it all a dream oh oh so that's how we're uh, justifying it in our head I guess that was supposed to happen that night. I think. Also, I need to get one more uh, game. For this month, for October. Because we're going to play this. Hopefully I'll, I'm going to finish this tonight. Uh, Layers of Fear. That's only like a... Four to six hour game. Something like that. So I, I want to get one more game in. I'm trying to think of what it could be. Um, so if anyone has any suggestions... I would like it to be horror or horror adjacent. Uh, one of the games I was thinking of was maybe Castlevania, Symphony of the Night. It's not really horror, but it's, I don't know, vampire themed. But, yeah. If anyone's got any ideas, Castlevania's good. Yeah, people tend to unanimously think that Castlevania is alright. Bayo 3? I, I do have Bayo 3. Punched in yet. Thought I saw something. Oh, looks like we entered Silent Hill.
Oh, there's someone in there. Is that the little who again? Is he here? Where'd it go? I'm gonna watch him more in the closed circuit then. There's just TVs here now? Do we only sell TVs? What are you wearing? Shorts and flip flops? What's wrong with you? I'm just gonna turn left and then. Kid's not doing anything like cool or anything. Just walking around looking at TVs. Oh, I didn't read the note. There is no note. Because manager is dead. Does the kid stop to look at these, or what? I think that's like, wrong answer. Try again. So I think I'm supposed to lo observe the kid on the thing. Look at the ones that he interacts with. Okay, I can't exit. So I can't go out to that outhouse. Okay, so let's observe. Punk ass kid. So it's that TV on the end there, right? Okay. Look right under the Which TV is that? Oh, 
Okay. Third one in. Okay, that TV. And the end. Well, which one is that? Can't tell which one that was. Try this again. Now, which one are you looking at? Looking up. So it's the upper TV. Okay. That TV. Got it. Looking down. I can't tell which one that is. Is that the one at the end? I think it's the one at the end. The middle one. Okay, I never did that one. So up, bottom, middle, and then it's like this one at the edge here, right? So top, top, bottom, and then middle. See, I can't tell which one it was for these. I did that wrong. It's the bottom one. This one?
that one done? looking at I guess I'm gonna watch the kid again I thought I for sure had that is he looking middle well maybe he was not looking up on that one he was looking middle Okay. This one, he certainly looks up. Was well, he looking like to the top? Oh my god. Looking down. Maybe that one's not in the end. Maybe he's looking at the third one in. God, there's so many possibilities now. Second one in for sure, middle. That one's that top one for sure. Top one for sure. Yeah, this one's like fourth shelf up. Fourth shelf up there. That was like second TV in on the bottom. All right, I could do it this time. it up already didn't I there is no fourth shelf one Like, I understand the puzzle, but it's just, like, it telling me what it wants me to do. There's, like, there's enough slop in it where I just can't precisely figure out what they want from me. Like, this one right here. Second one in middle. For sure.
This is a edge. Top row. For sure. You're looking up there, right? I can't tell where you're looking here. You look like you're, you're going... S I can't tell which one that is. There isn't a good view on that. I didn't mean to exit, but I don't believe this. Am I just not supposed to do this? Like, it has to be this. It's the only feedback it's giving me. This one's the one on the end, on top, third shelf. He's not looking at mid shelf, is he? He like stands in between uh, two sets of TVs. Okay, fourth shelf. That top TV. And I can't tell where his feet are. Still can't tell. I mean, that looks like top shelf to me, but maybe it's not. But I'm gonna try. Top shelf. And then.
maybe it's this one. This is my last combo. I don't, I don't understand. Patterns on the ground don't mean to, don't want to tell me anything. Is someone looking at that TV? Whatever's trying to haunt me, just kill me now. I'm undeserving of your haunting. I've said this before, but I will find every wrong way to do something. looking at maybe he's looking at the TV on the ed middle TV on the end and then this one I think is uh, top shelf doesn't really look like top shelf like way top Okay, so look at where he turns here, and then how quick, how far does he walk in? That might be the end, or it's the one in. Oh, I can't tell. And this is second from the end, middle. This is the real horror, the real horror to me. Not the hauntings, this is the perpetually being stuck. It looks like he's looking up there, but. Maybe he's looking down at the bottom on this one. And I still don't know if it's this one or that one on this. So we gotta try a bunch of combinations. Okay, now the same thing, but just with this TV.
Maybe it's the low one? I'll do the one closer to me, then I'll do the one on the edge later. one but down with the low one in the middle I don't know what else I'm supposed to do here. I've tried like 40 different combinations. I don't know what looking back at this could, how this will yield different results. Like is he looking up or, like I think he's looking at the TV on the third shelf. Now he's going to go look at the fourth shelf TV. And I'm looking at where his feet are. Like he's lined up with that TV and then the top. So the fourth TV in, straight to the top. And then this one, you can't even see where he is. Looks like this TV on the inside. And then it looks like the one in the center of this box here. Like I already tried that combo. Am I not supposed to be doing this? Like, is this just like, not what I'm supposed to be doing? But the kid certainly walked into this aisle before looking at the TV. TVs in from here. One, two, three, four. Top. And now just do the same things. First, I'll try middle, then I'll try the bottom. But I will now do it with this TV. Okay, now I'll try the bottom. I don't understand. I can't leave. I can't interact with anything.
You could turn these TVs on too. I mean, this is my entire playthrough, is just playing this part of this. I'm just gonna look it up. Like, this is... This shouldn't be happening. I don't understand. How am I so bad at this? I see him. Oh, God. Turn that one on? Where's someone that's not going to horribly cut this video together? I do not want any spoilers. Being really careful. That is not the right TV.
he looking at this TV, the fourth TV in? I gotta look at this again. No way he's looking at the fourth TV in. It so doesn't look like that from the other angle. So is this TV? And then it wasn't that TV, it was this one? I, I counted four T I looked at his feet and it was certainly that far away. Okay, that was it. Not normal noises from a Oh Well we're out of Silent Hill. I did I disagree with that also I'm looking online and their resolutions are way higher than mine <laughs> it was just, like they can actually see oh I could throw it in the trash no I gotta watch it That's me. like a night tear where like I can open my eyes but I can't move I I can't move get ending two. Well, I was enjoying the game until I got stuck on that puzzle. Maybe I'm just bad at puzzles. But, uh, I just couldn't see where that person was standing. I looked at it like ten times. And it kind of killed the atmosphere. It was good. It was a fun little game.
I wouldn't hesitate to play another one of their games. What are the endings? But it definitely did a good job, like, building atmosphere. I mean, there's three endings. So it's just, like, what I do with the videotape at the end, it looks like. Is this a good one to watch? Okay, let's just watch that. Thank you for playing. You're welcome. I enjoyed that. I felt like it could have been a little bit longer to kind of build the routine a little bit more. Give me a little more busy work. Overall, it was enjoyable. The grandma was... was certainly something. Like no audio on this? Do they like put their own audio on this? What do they get copyright strike? So they put their own audio on this? So like, is there no endings for this? Try this one. All right, this one has sound. Send it off to someone. I was sickened by the whole situation. I sealed the VHS tape carefully and decided to send it off to the sender. Fortunately, the sender's address was on the box. When I was done preparing to send it off, I felt my tense shoulders relax. Too much had happened in a short span. My mind couldn't keep up. I knew I had to rest, but I couldn't fall asleep. Everything about the store terrified me. Inevitably, I had to sit down on a chair to clear my head. What did I see? Was everything I witnessed even real? Although I was scared, I knew I had to know the truth. I wanted to know what happened and why, so I turned to the internet about the store. Oh, hi kitty. I can't read. I'll read on a different screen. I found a few art old articles and forums talking about the location and where the building was made. One comment on a strange forum stood out to me. It said, There seems to have been a gruesome killings at the property. I searched for the same user's comments in 2009. That case was where a man who made the mainstay of the family committed a murder-suicide. I determined to investigate the incident further. September 14th, the man killed his child with a kitchen knife while his wife was off to the grocery shopping to the local supermarket. When the wife came back, it was said that she was killed in an extreme way, and then he hung himself on the same day. They say that the woman was pregnant at the time of her death. The woman was killed with several nails punctured into her along with her child in her stomach. I wanted to throw up from the obscene images, but I knew I had to continue. There was a guy that replied to the comment and said he worked at the same place as him. According to him, the man was often harassed by his boss at work, and he had complained to several colleagues, and on the day of the incident, it is said that he had an emotionless face. 
Imagining what the family had gone through. Depression and hatred occupied my head. It was very painful. With tears in my eyes, I closed the internet gently and called the manager to talk about everything I'd experienced during the night shift and what I'd discovered. However, the calls were never picked up. It was the same over and over again. Then I received a phone call from Mr. Hosso, the franchise leader who I'd never met. I had a bad feeling about it. Then with a shivering voice, he said, The manager is dead. I couldn't breathe, so it wasn't a dream. And when I asked about the place where it was found, Mr. Hosso said that there was an old storage behind the convenience store and he was found there a day of his death. I dropped my phone. I quit my part-time job with a broken feeling. After quitting, I would avoid going to the convenience store wherever, whenever I could because every time I passed in front of the store, I would always feel a sharp stare towards me. I wouldn't be able to help but to try and pass as quickly as possible so not to look at the building. A day later, the store had closed down. The reason seemed to be due to poor management, but further details were not publicized. At that point, I didn't have the means or the courage to examine it anymore. After a while, the memories of the convenience store started to haze down a bit. One day, as I passed by the now closed down store, I heard a child's voice. Then I saw a woman. Was that the woman that gave me the talisman? Like, I never saw a. Oh, the woman is like the scary. tall. monster figure. But she's the one that killed me. Is that supposed to be the husband? I'm confused. And this is credits. Then if I put it in the trash. Oh, if I watch it, it just does the night terror ending. What if I trash it? This is only two endings. There are a throw it in the trash one. <laughs> this guy. Uh, I think I'm, I think I've seen enough. <sighs> Man, that was, that was fun. It was decent. It was good. Just, I was just stuck on one part just because if I could make a mistake, it's because I can't quite read the small details. I will make that mistake every time. All right. Um. No more. St no. No more streams tonight. Um. I think I'll just pop this in the old spreadsheet. The convenience store. I got ending. Oh, ending dos. Hi, kitty. Hello. I can't even see what I'm doing. Hello. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I can look over here. Did I do it right? No. That's what's happening, computer. Yeah. That's game number, what, 155? Yep. 155 games beat. And then uh, Layers of Fear should be another quick game. I'll be playing that tomorrow. Uh, I need to buy it and then like set up the VR. It might take a little bit. And I imagine it's like a four-hour game, so it'll take a couple streams to beat that one. And hopefully that one goes a little more, more smooth than this one. I, just, I was just struggling. All right. Um, let's toss a raid over. To our good friend Cod Veteran, nineteen 
84. I bet I know what he's playing. Holy shit. <laughs> he's got some uh, Halloween themed makeup on. This looks sick. But let's raid uh, Kai Veteran. He's a good friend of mine. I've hung out with him in Discord a few times. He's played some Mario Kart with us. And he supports the stream a lot. So I'd like to give old COD veteran a raid and should check out <laughs> his sweet costume. Hopefully he didn't get into like a horrible accident. That's just what I'm commenting on. But yeah, thank you, everyone. Um, I'll be back tomorrow. Peace out, everyone.